This is our history. Entebbe Young Soccer Academy was founded in 1996 February by the young star by then called Tamale Pinto Chiwanuka. This man was a young star at his youthful age and a great football lover. So after playing soccer for a very long time, he had the idea to share his talent with by the then youth who were around the community of Entebbe Kitoro. So at Kiwafo playground is where he decided to place a group of youths and share his skills with them. So in that process, that's how the club started. So Entebbe Soccer Academy was born on February uh, 1996. We have a lot of stories of success from uh, Entebbe Young Soccer Academy through all the years. Uh, people, like, uh, people like Dennis Guma playing for the Uganda Cranes, uh, guys like Benjamin Ochan also playing for Uganda Cranes and in the Uganda Premier League. But I think right now is one of the foreign countries playing soccer. Other players like Mur Murshid Juko is also a Uganda Cranes uh, striker. He's also a product of Entebbe Young Soccer Academy under uh, the, 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 the management of uh, Coach Pinto Chiwanuka Tamale. We have players like uh, Kalema. Uh, Kalema is a very good midfielder. And then uh, Yoweri Chisache is also a very good midfielder. All these guys are very successful football players. But their stories begin from this very football ground. One of our great players who never featured in any of the national games with the Uganda Crane is called Jimmy. Jimmy Bagea is a very good striker, very fast, very talented. He can strike balls from all points. Uh, Jimmy right now plays for the Kenyan Premier League, I think uh, Tasca FC. He's a very good striker. All these players didn't have enough to train. Uh, they could simply use the, 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 the little supplies they had because there was no substantial uh, support from any sponsors by then. So most of them were actually supported by their own parents with supplies, things like soccer boots, uh, training kits, or even uh, match day supplies, you can talk about drinks or eats during the match time. And then transportation was done on a community based. So the community would uh, donate money for transportation to uh, match venues. It was a tough time, I must say. Uh, but uh, we finally, they, they finally made it. They finally made it. It's a good deal. So we, we are so we are so grateful for their success, uh, for their stories of success. Their stories of success is a great inspiration to the young talents. So as we are 
teaching these young kids, as we are training these young kids, we emphasize them to look up to these guys as uh, stories, as, as stories of success. They should look at these guys as examples, and we also encourage them and tell them that they can make it, and that's how soccer is supposed to be. So I call upon all the football-loving parents to send all your kids for training with us. We shall teach them how to play soccer. We shall train them and we shall make them very good professional footballers. So if there is anything you want to tell us, you can log on to our website or even in the, in the comment section below on how to find us, share with us and connect to us. Thanks very much for watching. Please share, subscribe, donate and connect to us. Thank you.